We had um, this incredible speaker, Dr. Joanne Deek, come to speak to our school community about the importance of being confident and competent young women and making change in your own community. The day after we had Joanne speak to our students, this student wore pants and um, I politely told her that it was not part of our school uniform but uh, that I was open to having the conversation with her and that if she felt really strongly she should put a proposal in for pants to be part of the school uniform. That night the student went home and created a very lengthy proposal, very detailed and thoughtful. The next day I arrived at school and about 10 to 15 girls were now wearing pants. Just before classes started our head girl Maggie arrived at my office door and said we need to talk about pants. <laughs> so uh, we had a great meeting about uh, the importance of hearing from all voices in our community and we set up a meeting for the following week to invite our entire student body and faculty to have a conversation about incorporating pants in, as part of our uniform. Well, I've been thinking about pants for quite a long time, probably since grade seven or eight, but the real big moment when I realized that I really wanted to make an impactful change was after we had a speaker, um, Joanne Deek, come and talk to us, and she talked about empowering young women and how we could create change in our own community. And that was when I first discovered that this was something I really wanted to take into action. We heard loud and clear that our girls want pants, and and we started looking at um, the types of pants that would uh, fit and be comfortable for every girl. And here we are today, several months later, but we have chosen a pant. We've had girls uh, giving feedback on various pants and we've now decided on a pant and the girls are thrilled and we're thrilled that as a progressive school that we're continuing with our tradition and the girls will have pants as of uh, fall 2017.